Welcome back! We're doing another dollar store haul, but this time we're doing a taste test Tuesday. So, if this is uploaded the day it's supposed to, it'll be on a Tuesday! Remember guys, if you want to see my videos and get notified about them, you have to subscribe and you gotta hit the bell. Or you won't know. Moving on. My next video is a Taste Test Tuesday. Now, before we get started, I stole this idea. I really thought about what I wanted to do in the past year, because you know I've had time to think about it. And there is this girl. I love her. Her name is Pink Sparkles. That's pink with two eyes. Do not worry. She's linked below. I love her. I don't want her to come for me. I want her to know that I'm inspired by her. I'm pretty sure she's Canadian too. So, we're back with the dollar store stuff, and this time, we gonna eat some stuff. I got lots of fun things, some nostalgic things, some things that I wanted to try. So without further ado, let's go to it. So, I don't, I don't know where to begin. I'm, I've only got a couple little things because sugar's bad, and I don't want to snack too much. Um, okay, we're gonna start off with our childhood. Now, who remembers fruit roll-ups? Again, my camera's being weird. Fruit roll-ups. When I was a kid, these things used to have embossed things on it. They, I remember at one point, okay, okay, it's happening. So we've got the roller, and they still put that parchment paper on it. That is amazing. Ah, I'm so excited. Now, when this looks like bacon. I wish you could see it. So, when I was a kid, Fruit roll-ups used to have these embossed uh, images on it, whether they were wizards or cats or whatever. Oh my gosh, this is taking forever. Okay. Yes. It still breaks apart the way you want. Guys, this was our childhood. It's so gross. <laughs> it tastes just like a childhood. It tastes just like a childhood. That's what I said. So, my flavor that I'm trying today is tropical tie-dye. Apparently, tropical tie-dye is a thing. So good. So, the next thing I wanted to try is the gummy worms. So, these are a dollar store knockoff. These are a dollar. The fruit by the foots were a dollar. We're doing well, guys. We're saving my bank account, and we're doing well. Oh, so, let's try... Let's try a traditional red and green gummy worm, shall we? They're good. They don't taste anything like a normal one that you would get in your convenience store. They almost taste... They almost taste like the fruit snacks that you get from your parents at lunchtime when you may have had a fruit roll-up. They are not as sweet. I really like them. I just had three. Okay. The next thing we're going to try today are Teddy Crisps. Now, these are... Teddy Grahams, but they're not, okay? I'm not gonna lie, guys. I've had these a lot. These are one of my favorite things to get at the dollar store. For $1.50, you get this huge bag. There's 200 grams, and they are so good. They're chocolate chip flavor, and the best thing about them is that you can taste the chocolate. You know how sometimes they'll have... I wish I could show you a close-up, but I can't, because you know my camera's shit. And the sound's probably shit, too, but that's okay, because you are going to stick around and wait for me to get better quality. Now, the thing I like about these is that they're a cookie, but they've also got mini chocolate chips. So unlike some, where they just might mix a little bit of chocolate dough in with that, so good. They almost taste Grammy, you know what I mean? Like, not a vanilla flavor, like a graham cracker. So good. Moving on. The next thing I did was for the kid in you. Or for the kid you may have. This is a giant Canadian chocolate bar. The reason why I got this is because I wanted to test out the chocolate quality on a milk chocolate bar. This is huge. And this cost me $2. Imagine being a child and walking into the dollar store with 3 bucks and being like, Hi, I bought this giant chocolate bar. And my sister bought this. <gasps> that was for my last video. I wanted it to make look... Uh-oh, now you know I shot them back to back. Anyways, fuck it. So, I'm just going to try a little piece. Oh my god, guys. Never mind, never mind. I thought they all had Canadian things on them. They, only, they have four-leaf clovers. I, that's Irish, not Canadian. But here we go. 
it's okay. If I was a kid with three dollars and I bought that, I'd be pretty happy. And my friends would be pretty jealous. But as an adult with a bank account, it's not that great. It's not that great. But what this would be great for, baking. Chocolate chip cookies, anything. You gotta put something in there. Look how big this is. Look how big that is. Mmm. So good, guys. Now, the thing I have been most excited for are these. They're called Pyramid Bars. I'm so excited about these. What these are, are chocolate-covered hazelnut cream wafers, and they are in a shape of a pyramid, my favorite Illuminati symbol. Oh my gosh, guys. They're individually wrapped. They're individually wrapped. Now, do we need all this wrapping? No, we don't. Dollar store, one thing I have noticed is I have a lot of garbage on my hands. You individually wrap things, whatever. Now, for one bar, this is 180 calories. That's not bad. You can just look up your sugar yourself. I'm not I'm not here to be a nutritionist or a dietitian, but you know what guys? I'm excited. I love a good pyramid. I love a good symbol. Wish me luck. I love hazelnut. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. This is delicious. It's a hazelnut chocolate wafer. But I'm gonna tell you straight up, bitches, I'm tasting coffee crisp. Okay, coffee crisp. Let's talk about that for a sec. If you are not from Canada, you don't know what a coffee crisp is. You need to get your ass to the dollar store and buy one of these. Coffee crisp is our, it's a wafer coffee cookie chocolate bar. They are amazing. They reign supreme. It is personally my favorite. So now I'm loving these pyramid bars. Oh, so good. Dollar Store, thank you so much for providing all this great stuff. Hashtag not sponsored, hashtag but should be. It was delicious. Everything was really good. Um, the chocolate was a little bit of a mess, but I, I thought that it was good. It was good. Let's get real. But I would use it for baking or something. If I was seven, I would love that. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for taking the time to indulge me in my weirdness. I really love making these videos. I want to make more for you because I'm creative and this helps me get creative. Thank you so much. I hope you like and remember, like this video, subscribe, hit the bell, make a comment. I don't know. I love you guys. You're amazing. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Bye guys.